Gavin Moynihan Photo Pat Cashman Gavin Moynihan is confident he can turn an already memorable year into an unforgettable one by grabbing his European Tour card at the qualifying school in Spain. A year ago, he was licking his wounds after missing out at the first stage, locking his clubs in the garage for nearly a month before working out what he was going to do next. The answer was to call Black Bush teaching professional Shane Agrati for his first golf lesson for more than 10 months following the sudden death of his longtime coach Hugh Jackson the previous September. Today, he's got Category 18 status on the European Tour, confidence to burn and a top-10 finish in mind as he tees it up at Lumin Golf Club with Rory McGee, Cormac Charvin and Dermot McElroy seeking to improve his status at the marathon, six-round final stage. I am looking forward to it, said Moynihan, who finished 19th on the Challenge Tour money list this season, just €12,000 outside the top 15 who earned automatic promotion to the main tour for 2018. All in all it's been a very positive year on the course out here. After starting the year with no category at all, I can be proud. It's been a remarkable 12 months for the two-time Walker Cup player, who regained his confidence under Agrati, who has coached Leona McGuire to number one in the World Amateur Golf Ranking. While he had some guaranteed challenge tour starts via Team Ireland Golf, Moynihan had to go to the third tier Euro Pro Tour Q school in March to find somewhere to play and then went out and won his first event. Three weeks later he headed to Spain for a new, nine-hole match play event on the Challenge Tour and reached the final. Golf was suddenly fun again, and it showed in Moynihan's results as he racked up nine top 25s and 18 Challenge Tour starts and another one on the European Tour at the Irish Open. The final stage of Q School is torture for most but, with between 10 and 12 European Tour starts guaranteed next term, Moynihan is virtually stress-free. Considering it's the final stage, it's a pretty relaxed week for me this week, he beamed. I can just go for it this week if I play well, great, if I don't it's not the end of the world for me. I started the year with nothing, absolutely nothing. I was at the Euro Pro Q school in March just trying to get a bit of form going, so to have had the year I've had is incredible really. Moynihan missed just two cuts on the Challenge Tour all year, but it were his performances in European Tour events that convinced him that he has the game to win on tour. His closing 64 for a share of 14th in the Dubai duty-free Irish Open at Port Stewart just one of the 30 rounds in the 60s he posted this year showed he's a special talent. The biggest thing was I'd only missed two cuts, he said. I think last year I'd only made about three. Overall it's been such a positive year that I can just look forward to this week and see it as a bonus if it all goes well I've got nothing to lose so I'm going to be aggressive and see how it ends up. He's not the only Team Ireland golf recipient going for glory. Balamina's McElroy 24 is making his second visit to the final stage since 2013 while Darius McGee will be at the last chance saloon for the third year in a row. It's the first time at the final stage for Moynihan and Ardglis Sharvin 23, who fired a 64 in the final round of Stage 2 to make the final stage. Irish Independent